ever bless. Welcome in the studio, come out 92.4. Fit to worry in Aile. the house. Blessed. Bless I say, I give thanks for the invitation. You welcome every time. Slash. Yes, it's an honor for us to have you here. Yes, sir. Um, tell me something about you, Fitawari. Who is Fitawari? What is he doing? Well, um, Fitawari is simply the vanguard leader because um, Fitawari is an Amharic word, and Amharic is the language spoken in Ethiopia. And yeah, when I translate that in English, it's the vanguard leader that is like. The vanguard is the front part of the army, you know, so yeah, the vanguard leader of Itawari, musically. Yeah, yeah. Do you have an army behind you? An army, yes. I have my three children at home, yeah, yes. the, my army, you know, but musically, yeah, the ancestors are behind me and that's my army, yeah. All right. You are a roots artist with um, with some influences from the dance hall. I read that uh, Everton Blender and Luciano are your biggest influences, your idols, is that right? Well... Yeah, not really, because, you know, yeah, we have to remember the fireman Capitan who come and start the more fire thing. Yeah, Sizzla Kalonji and the new breed now, like Kranix, Kabaka Pyramid and Protogee, yeah. Yeah, man. Do you, do you work together as a, as a, like a camp or, or do you influence your, the artists? Do they influence each other? How, how? Well, yeah, for me still, you know. I don't deal with partiality in music, so even if it's a no-name artist with a good song, it influences me. Yeah, yeah. So that's where my thing is, bless. What's, what's, your, what's your main message for the people out there listening to us now? Well, it's a four-letter word, love. <laughs> love. Yeah, because only that can heal the world. Yeah, what's, uh, do you have a current project upcoming or some new singles, tunes out there? Where can we get it? Well... At the moment, yeah, I'm doing a project with um, the African House, um, that is the root center from Cologne, King C. Red, who organizes the root center at Summer Jam. Currently, we are working on an album with him, you know, we want to like um, support the local people who are trying to push themselves just like me too, so yeah. And with one and two other people like House of Rhythm and with Oneness, we have a lot of You know, singles far and wide, you know, with different people all over the world, from Jamaica to, but not the big names, because most of the big names just looking for big names artists, mm -hmm. you know, so yeah. We just work with the underground people at the moment, one and two of the yeah, House of Rhythm and these type of people. Yeah, underground is where the real crea cre creativity, creativity is coming from, you know. True, true. True, true. Um, yeah, what's, what's your... Yeah. Oh man, I lost, I lost, what, do you have a question? <laughs> I lost the words. I lost the words, no, sorry. You can speak in German because, you know, I live here, so I understand a little bit of the language too, so, yeah. All right, but I would prefer to speak in, in English, English because okay. it fits you more, you're the, our True. guest, so. Yeah. Yeah. Um, do, um, do you have a tour right now in Germany or, or are you only for one, one gig here in Munich? Well, yeah, for, for one gig in Munich, but yeah. like, um. In, in two weeks, I'm going on the road with Zion Train, that is uh -huh. this um, dub, dub people from England, you know. And currently, I'm doing most of my things with um, Zion Train at the moment, you know. So, in, in the next two weeks, I'll be going to France, uh -huh. Italy, and then um, Poland. Enough work to do for you, man. Well, sometimes it's like that, you know, it's like hills and valleys, sometimes highs, sometimes lows, that's life. <laughs> it's the life of an artist, right? Yeah, man. Yeah, man. And for me as a family man, again, you know, sometimes it's not good to be too much away from the youths, you know, so the youths need the vanguard leader to lead them, can't be too much away from them, have yeah. to be with them sometimes. Are, you, are, you, are your children also musical gifted or are, are they more into sports or what's... I think more musically gifted because... Yeah. Um, I also do my little um, individual promotional videos to like promote myself and yeah, I, I've, I've got a video with my son which I've did like over four years now, it's called Burn, Burn It Sababa. So my children definitely, I, I see that the genes of music is also in them, you know? Mm. Yeah, they, they, they are music, you know? Yes, I. It's all right. 
you you name a few artists before like Protege, Kabaka Pyramid, Chronic. So what do you think about the new the new reggae revival? The, here in Germany they call it the reggae revival. Yeah, yeah, right? so, yeah. so yeah. So what do you think about that? Well, you know, I'm, I was very happy when I saw this happen because it's like reggae music was going dead. You know, it was going down into the coffin and Chronics. Kabaka Janine and all this new set which rise up really empowered me and I say yes Ja give thanks that this really happened because it was like Jamaica was going off the world map now but you know these people come and yeah bring yeah. back the vibe you know and they're really successful that means the the people that need the positive messages right definitely yeah you know? because reggae music is all about the positivity but I don't know what True. happened over the years now dance all with this type of slackness and a woman or demon thing or gun thing come and really hit the positivity out of the people's sight and the people were like getting straight away but yeah the positivity rise again you know give thanks right, for that yeah. man yeah man and i mean in jamaica the main influence to the young generation is music naturally yeah yeah really <laughs> really really <Naturally. laughs> sorry so we hope it getting more peaceful with with uh good roots music down in, in Jamaica well you know you know Jamaica is always on that level we are here the crime is gonna always be there because of the guns which the politicians and the governments bring in but music can really revive them is like a redemption so you know these artists have to always be on that level it's not like some artists they start out culturally and over the years they really fade down to become slacky tidy you know so called Right. Yeah, man. Mm -hmm. True. So, Pete, go on. <laughs> your, questions, <laughs> you, you have... your questions are really, really good right now. <laughs> so, all right. What the people gonna ex have to expect of the Vanguard leader for tonight? Well, um, just like um, um, one most important thing that um, every artist have to know. If you have a name, just try to be your name. I'm the vanguard leader, so yeah, you're not gonna hear me sing nothing about Under Woman, but like I sing on dancehall rhythms, I do on dub rhythms, I do on reggae rhythms, any rhythm. So it's all about the message. Yeah, so you know, I lead the people sometimes. Yeah, you have dancehall people, they wanna hear a little dancehall beat, I sing something consciously on a dancehall beat. Yeah, that's me, you know, always conscious message on different yeah. beats, you know, so people can just expect to hear any type of rhythm. But the message gonna always remain conscious, you know. Yes, sir. All right. So you you uh, born and grow in born and raised in Jamaica. Yes, sir. So when when did you start um, with the view of Rastafari in your life? Well, it was what you call uh, the triple nine behind the one, 1999. <laughs> And I'm the vice versa to Bob Marley in, in a sense where Bob Marley was born in Senton but he grew up in Kingston. Yeah. I was born in Kingston but grew up in Senton, so it's like the vice versa to Bob Marley in that way, you know. So 1999 Rastafari came to me because first I was a barber, you know. I used to cut people cut here. <laughs> <laughs> but then one day, you know, something dramatic happened and yeah, it's just like the powers show me that, you know, no more hair cutting. So I went into the mountains. Start to plant some marijuana, corn, yeah, grown provision. Yeah. And just, yeah, Rastafari start to, yeah, get bigger and broader and fit a worry, you know. All right, so you, you've been a barber before. Yes, I. Now I have a great song just for you. All right. For Mr. Barber, <laughs> Mr. <laughs> Fitawari. Yeah, born the barber. <laughs> Cheers, the barber. Yes. All right, so I play one tune for Fitawari. Aye, aye, aye. Run it. Yeah, man. Kleinen Moment dauert es wohl noch.
first of all, I know ya. The first, yeah. Hey, King Celestia, and this we tell them on a lie. Say, man, a Rasta, he a liar. Healing King Alpha and Queen Omega. Man, a Rasta, Kuya. I am a Yatran Chon Fire. Man, a Rasta, he a liar. I am a Yale King Alpha and Queen Omega Man a Rasta, Koya I am a Yale Gwan Burn the Fire Man a Rasta, I say from them origin Healing still a say I the kings of kings Burn Babylon, them of the devil is in Children, this woman sing, I sing I am a Yale Rasta for a Yale Spring And I this me say we chant and I sing Man a Rasta From deep within, Van Gogh laid a rockling. Yo, man a Rasta, he a liar. Yelling King Alpha and Queen Omega. Man a Rasta, Koya. I am a ya trad show fire. Man a Rasta, he a liar. Yelling King Alpha and Queen Omega. Man a Rasta, Koya. I am a ya trad show fire. Rastafari I burn down Babylon Cause them system wrong Long time we are chant repatriation I know them don't give us no reparation Rasta no deal with separation No segregation We come a preach unification to all nation Man a Rasta, he a liar I am a Yael King Alpha and Queen Omega Man a Rasta, Koya I am a Yael Trad Chon Fire Man a Rasta, he a liar Yael King Alpha and Queen Omega Man a Rasta, Koya I am a Yael Trad Chon Fire Rastafari Yes, ha 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 Ja, Mann. So, das war ein kleines Live-Stückchen von Fittavari. Ja, Mann. Real. Respect Fittavari. Every time. Ja, Mann. Some last words for our, for our listeners, for the people tonight. Yeah. Do you have some last words to tell them? Well, you know, people, I haven't been in Munich over six years, so... All of my fans, supporters, I needed to turn out and support, you know, because it's 10 years anniversary of Riders Tribe. And, you know, we need to give the youth support because they are the future. So when you support the future, you support yourself. So turn out and you will get some good live reggae music in your soul. Turn out whether you're young or old. Can't say you've never been tall. Turn out one and all. Love you. <laughs> yeah, man, it was a real honor for us to have you here. It yes, was a I. pleasure and honor to have you here. Bless up. Give thanks, Mr. Fitawari. Und wenn ihr ihn live hören wollt, dann kommt auch heute in Sunny Red. Um 23 Uhr geht's los mit Rider Sound, Soul Shake, Mr. Fitawari. Und noch dabei die Humble Kids, die hat man auch schon sehr lange nicht mehr gesehen. Ja. Yeah. Und Jabba und The Dome sind natürlich auch wieder mit am Start. Genau, und wer nicht kommt, ist doof. Gleich Schuhe anziehen und losgehen und nicht so lange auf dem Sofa hängen, sonst wird das nichts mehr. Also bewegt euch zum Feuerwerk. Zack, es, zack. Es gibt ja auch noch eine neue Veranstaltung, ja? Wurde mir gerade noch von, von meiner Soufflöse Tina. <lacht> Sie filmt Big auch Tina bei der Kamera. La job. Genau, die, die Kamerafrau und Soufflöse. Das Tina, Kamerakind. Die, das Kamerakind Tina, das gerade im Studio steht. Nee, es gibt eine neue Veranstaltung im Pilots und es das heißt Pull-Up Thursday. Ach, stimmt, ich hörte davon. Ja, ja, also jeder, der mal am Donnerstag unter der Woche nichts zu tun hat, der kann einfach ins Pilots, in die Schillerstraße, glaube ich, ist es, mhm. kommen. Ja. Und da gibt es auch Reggae Music to the Maximum. Voriges Mal waren sogar Open Decks, das heißt, jeder kann ein bisschen was spielen. Oh, wie schön. Pull-Up Thursdays. Pull-Up Thursday. Yes. I will say pull-up, 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 pull-up,